case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1981, the Supreme Court of the United States heard the case of Shad v. Borough of Mount Ephraim, which revolved around the limits of local governments regulating land use through zoning and the Constitution. Two bookstore owners from Mount Ephraim, New Jersey, were fined for violating a zoning ordinance that prohibited live entertainment in commercial zones. They argued that this restriction infringed upon their constitutional rights to free expression. The owners had installed coin-operated devices in their store that allowed customers to watch adult films and live dancers behind a glass panel. The lower court upheld the convictions, but the Supreme Court ultimately ruled in favor of the bookstore owners. The court found that live entertainment was protected under the First Amendment and that Mount Ephraim had not provided enough justification for the restriction on this protected activity. The court determined that the borough of Mount Ephraim could only restrict commercial live entertainment if it demonstrated greater problems than other permitted uses. The total exclusion of all live entertainment, including non-obscene nude dancing protected by the First Amendment, was deemed unreasonable. To be considered acceptable, the ordinance would have to be narrowly tailored, and the borough had not shown that less restrictive measures could not meet its interests. Thus, the lower court erred in affirming the appellant's convictions, and the Supreme Court ruled in favor of the bookstore owners. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law, elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.